Hi friends, I'm Sherry Sherry's Plants and in today's video, I'm gonna film a weekly plan with me for November 21st through the 27th. So let's get into it. Friends, to introduce myself, I'm Sherry Sherry's Plants. I share my planner ideas, reviews, and inspirations here on YouTube and on Instagram. And I've got no Facebook group, so check those out in the links in the description. And in today's video, we are gonna film a, a quick little plan with me for November 21st through the 27th in my Erin Condren Vertical Life Planner here. And I am using Planner Kate Mini Kit 358. And this is called Gather. I think this is like just a super cute kit and it really feels like it's got the Thanksgiving vibe to me. So I picked up this kit and wanted to use it for the week of Thanksgiving. So I have here the weekly sampler sheet and I recommend if you are new to Planner K and don't know what you want and you know how you wanna plan with stickers and you're trying out something new, I recommend starting with the weekly sampler sheet here. It has scripts, it has um, little appointment labels and other half boxes and washi and full boxes. And it's I think it's just really gives you some stuff to try and it all coordinates the colors with the kit really nicely. Um, in the new year, 2022, there is um, there are some updates to the sampler sheet. So it's not gonna look exactly like this but um, still super functional. And I also picked up the full boxes and I don't normally pick up full boxes. It's not something I normally plan with, but I love the designs on here. And like I said, it really feels like Thanksgiving week to me. And I just thought it'd be cute to use full boxes this week instead of like washi, which I usually use. And I'll show you guys how I use that. And then I also picked up the individual date headers because I always pick those up. So, um, first thing, if you, I mean, I film probably plan with me's maybe like once a month, or I've been doing it for once a month for a while now. And, um, if you haven't seen my planner yet, I have, I had like a misorder. It was my error when I ordered my, um, life planner for the rest of the year. I use I usually use an academic year, but I had ordered like a full 2022, um, life planner. So I'm reusing like the back half of 2022 for this year. So I just have to like redate and cover up some dates in here really quickly. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. So as you can see, I had to redate my weekly spread here because I'm using, so I'm using a 2022 planner, right? But I also redate my planner to have a Sunday start. So I'm always buying date headers for my kits because I redate it to a Sunday start. And that's just because my days off, um, they're either Friday, Saturday, or Sunday, Monday, depending on um, what shift I'm working. And so it's just easier for me because I like to have those days off together. So no matter when my schedule changes, my days off will always be together on those on like the weekends there. I've been redating it with the Sunday start for like three years. So whenever I use sticker kits, I always have date headers that I use there. Um, I also put a full box down here on the bottom of, I also put a full box here on the bottom. It covers up the November 22, 2022 calendar. And I just like to have the full box there on the side. So, and then, so normally what I do when I'm planning out my weekly spread, on the days that I work, I usually block off like this middle section here with washi. Like I usually buy thick washi if I like the design, or I'll just use some coordinating washi from my um, collection here. But I bought the full boxes, so I'm gonna use these full box stickers. And I just wanna decide which ones I wanna use. I think what I wanna do first is I'm gonna put this Happy Thanksgiving guy on this top one here. And I'm definitely putting it here on the top and not here in the middle because I'm off work that day. So I want it to be clear that, I mean, not that I won't know that I'm off, but I think I, I think I would like the way it looks better. Um, and these are just so cute. So I don't, I, I don't know how I want to do this. There's so many just really cute designs. I'm unfortunately like I got off work later with the time change and everything. So it's much darker earlier. I mean, y'all know this, but so I lost all my daylight. Anyways, I lost all my daylight today and I'm bummed about it. 
also I'm like working with shadows here. Okay, I don't want to give thanks and give thanks next to each other. So let's put this here. So trying to lay down my stickers in these shadows is proving to be tricky. Um, let's see. I did want to, I really want to use like all of these stickers. Hmm. They're just so cute. Okay. I don't know. Um, there are some things I wanted to say. So this video is going up on Friday at some point, depending on when I can get the editing done on it. And I decided the other day that I won't be posting, I won't be uploading any videos this week. Um, I work in the grocery industry. It's been a busy couple weeks for us just getting like stores and everybody ready for Thanksgiving and there's been sales and I've had lots of collaboration opportunities. So I've just been really busy. So I think just for this week, I mean, I'm still expecting to have a busy few days at the beginning of the week leading up to Thanksgiving. And um, then at the end of the week, I'm kind of just going to rest. So I'm not going to pressure myself with filming and editing more videos um, for this week. I'm still going to be, so I'm kind of taking a break, but I'm still going to be like active on Instagram and my Facebook groups. Um, it's just the filming and the editing of videos uploading new videos for this week that I'm going to take a break from. So I just want to give you guys that, that heads up um, for those of you who come to expect them. Um, I mean, it's a holiday week. I'm sure we all got tons of things we're doing with family or shopping. So I, I know I want to finish my um, class the class I'm working on, I really, I set a goal for myself to finish it by Saturday here. Um, we're going to see how that goes. Just, I know I'm going to have a busy work week. I'm probably going to be working late on a lot of days and just come home, like really just worn out and tired. So I'm really just like going to try to give myself some grace here and not plan um, too busy of a week. There's just like those like working out. I want to make sure that I'm doing. First of all, let me tell you guys a little bit. So like I said, I the days that I work, I started to say this. The days that I work, I usually put full boxes or something to block this middle of the day here. Um, I use the top boxes on the days that I work for the important things, the big things, um, the all day events, like stuff like that, that I want to make sure is like just top and foremost. Like if anything else, like these are the things I do for the day. And then at the bottom, I'll plan like um, how I'm going to spend my afternoons and evenings. And then on my days off, normally what I do is I kind of like just plan the day. I'll put, still put like the important stuff here at the top. But like the rest of these boxes, like two boxes, I'll fill in like the things I'm going to do that day in kind of the order I see them going. So that's... So that's how I plan using the vertical boxes here. So what I've done is I put my workouts at the top because that is an important thing to me. I wanna make sure that my workouts get done even though they get done after work, they're important so they go at the top. Um, any releases or sales or like I said, other all day things are gonna go up there at the top too. Uh, trash day is gonna go up here at the top because that's an important thing. Um, but what I was thinking about what I'm gonna do is like I said, I usually plan my things in the afternoons and I'll plan like a thing or two what I'm gonna do. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna give myself a half box and just plan one thing I'm gonna do. And I'm just going to plan one thing I'm going to do in the afternoons. Okay. So I'm just going to go across this week. 
Like I said, I don't know what time I'm going to get off work these days. I don't know how much energy I'm going to have. I have, like I said, I work in the grocery industry. I've been, um, I'm grocery distribution. I have been working for my company for over 14 years. I know exactly how Thanksgiving week goes and it is just going to be a doozy. By the end of this, I'm just going to need a break. My, let's see if I can do this day by day. I usually feel like super scattered when I'm planning my week, not just filming, but when I just plan my week and normally, like I feel like I'm just kind of all over the place and um, I'm gonna try to do this. So Sunday, I'm working out. I don't think there's anything else going on on Sunday in particular that I need to write down and remember. So I think Sunday I'm gonna give myself a study day keep it pretty simple this week because things could change and I don't want to have to move too many stickers around. So I have study time here, study time on Monday and then, I'm sorry, on Sunday. I have So I have my workout and then I have study time. That's gonna be kind of just what I'm gonna plan to do that day. Although really if, I don't know, I feel like, cause I know I need to like study and get like work done for school, but I also need to work out. but. I would not be surprised if just one of those things happens on Sunday. Monday, Monday, I'm just gonna plan on when I get home to walk the dogs. So Monday afternoons, I'm just planning on walking the dogs. I've been, so I've just been really trying to spend some time Mondays training my dogs, um, walking them, getting them used to like interacting with people. My goal is to be able to take my bigs more out on some hikes and walks and travel with them. So I've just really been like, that's my goal is to spend some time with them Mondays, just doing some training. So that's all we've got planned on Sunday and Monday. Oh, I think on um, Monday as well, if I remember correctly, um, Aaron Condren's Black Friday sale starts again for the general public. I have shopped the EC Insiders Early Access. So I made like most of the stuff I wanna purchase. However, I know there's more gift with purchases coming. I just don't know when, and I have seen some sneaks of those and there's something that I really wanna make sure I get. So there are a couple items still in my cart that I'm like waiting on purchasing for those gift with purchases that I want. Um, so I don't know if it's going to happen on Monday or when it's going to happen, honestly, but I'm going to mark this sale down. And so, yeah, I'm an affiliate for Erin Condren. Um, I share everything first in my Facebook group. It's easiest for me to schedule posts and post things first there early in the morning. So if you are wanting to see, um, information as soon as possible that is one place where i'll share it um i'll have the link for my facebook group in the description of this video please feel free to come and join us so you can see all the sales stuff and we'll see if we've got anything good coming up on monday ec sale black friday sale starts again how cute are these stickers these are from once more with love i absolutely love um her shop i've got a uh, million stickers from her and this one I think was new so I just thought it was super cute a little Black Friday and Cyber Monday and sale sales so super cute sheet I just got that in the other day okay so that's what is happening there on Tuesday I have nothing planned I have nothing written down nothing planned I think um and I'm not planning on working out that day, so I think we'll have that be another um, study day. We'll plan to have a study day. Perfect. Okay, Wednesday. Wednesday, Wednesday, Wednesday. Wednesday, thankfully, I don't think it's gonna be too busy at work. I think most of the craziness is happening here. Um, Wednesday should not be too bad um, historically. So I've got my workout planned and then I think I'm just going to plan one of two things. I am going to put down, I'm gonna put down this time to clean sticker and I'm gonna plan on doing some cleaning on, sun, on Wednesday here. 
So, as of right now, our Thanksgiving plans are not 100%. Um, let me know what your Thanksgiving plans are and if, if you know what they are. Let, let me know in the, in the comments of this video. But as of this moment, I am not sure what our plans are. Um, I think we thought we were going to host Thanksgiving and invite our neighbors over or just our next door neighbors, their family over and do Thanksgiving at our house. And now it sounds like we're invited over there. So if we're invited over there... I'm not going to cook as much and I'm not going to have to deep clean my house for company coming over. But for now, I'm going to put time to clean and then I might do Thanksgiving prep if we do wrangle them over here. If we do it at our house, then I'll do Thanksgiving prep on Wednesday as well um, and then clean the house. I, I am going to put in here though. <laughs> I think we all need this reminder in in our planners, but we have to defrost the turkey. So this is your reminder, friends. Um, put it in the planner, put it in your phone, do whatever you need to do, defrost that turkey. And I think if I defrost mine on Sunday, we should be good. I hope, I'm gonna try to find later. I bet I got a cute little turkey sticker somewhere in here. I bet I do, but I have so much going on over there. I'm not even going to look through those stickers. Okay, moving on. Part of me really wishes I had some like game day stickers, but I'm pretty sure I don't. Um, we have the Dallas Cowboy games. Looks like it's set 3.30. My time. I might find some cute stickers to decorate this with later, but I know on Thursday we've got Thanksgiving, we've got the football game, that's the plan. Like I said, I don't know if we're going next door or if we're coming over here, I'm not 100%, but there it is in the planner. I'll probably have to schedule a grocery pickup still on Friday at some point. I should put down Black Friday, a Black Friday sticker here because it is Black Friday. Although we will not be running around outside in all of the craziness that is Black Friday, but let's find. I'm still going to put it in here that it is Black Friday on Friday. Okay. Black Friday. Like I said, I think we'll probably still have our grocery pickup like I normally do on Friday. And then um, we're also planning on decorating our house, doing the Christmas decorations on Friday since I'm off. My boyfriend's off. I told him we should plan to do that on this Friday. Um, we always, not always, I guess we tend to like wait too late to decorate for Christmas. And then it's kind of like, oh, gosh, is it even worth it to do all this to have it up for like a week or two? So I told him, I'm like, we should do it the day after Thanksgiving, decorate for Christmas, put the tree up, put the lights up. So that's the plan for that day. Pattern in this full box next to it or above it. Um, we need to finalize our HelloFresh box. It's something like I keep forgetting to do on that day, but I want to make sure I remember to finalize the box on that Friday. Perfect. Okay. Let's give ourselves a laundry day sticker because I probably won't do laundry all week. And yeah, we'll definitely need to get it done. Saturday there. And I think otherwise, just the rest of this day is just going to be like a study day. Again, doing, doing some homework, doing some of that schoolwork, hopefully getting it done so that I can submit the final papers I need to do and finish this class this week. I think that's all I'm going to 
plan as I'll probably film too on this day my next week's videos I'll probably do some filming and editing on that day for next week's videos just to get <clears throat> a head start on that actually I'm pretty excited by the time I get around to filming this video here on Saturday um, I have December monthly plan with me to film and I'm super excited because I'm using a kit from Fern Creek Stickers and I'm very excited about that kit. I don't know if you guys saw like on Instagram and everything in my Facebook group where I was posting about like the shopping I was doing. But um, yesterday on Tuesday was Erin Condren's first day of the Black Friday sale. I put an order there. And then it was also VIP access to Moxie Life launch. So I put in my order there. And then Plum Paper was also having their early Black Friday sale. And I bought a planner for work for next year. And I did all that on Tuesday. So hopefully those items start shipping and I start receiving some of them by this week. So maybe I'll do some filming of some haul videos as well. Okay, to show you what I added here really quick, I leave a spot down here on the bottom boxes for dinners for the week. I'll write those in as soon as I have a better idea on what our plans are. Um, I've been putting in the weather and I kind of like it because even though like, the weather changes the highs and lows might change i can kind of have an idea like when my colder and warmer days will be and when we could probably expect a chance of rain which it looks like we have some um on thanksgiving day i also like this is how i've been using my sidebar is i have a section of just stuff i want to get done sometime during the week these are usually like the quick little uh, phone calls appointments um things to do then and then I give myself a section to write for next week stuff just to kind of like brain dump maybe some things I want to get done for next week. Oh, I did also add Fern Creek Stickers is supposed to be having their February releases on the 24th just in time for their Black Friday sale on Friday. So I'll probably be shopping that as that might be one of the only Black Friday sales that I'm actually know that I'm going to shop. Yeah, so I think that's everything I've got planned for this week. Like I said, it's it's just gonna be a week. I do just wanna say a quick reminder that I will be, I will not be posting videos this week. I'm gonna give myself that little break. I also wanna give you a reminder to, when you do shop, please check out my affiliate links. I have them listed in the description of this video. I am an affiliate for Erin Condren. I'm an affiliate for Planner Kate. I am an affiliate for Cultivate What Matters, and a lot of these um, shops are going to have Black Friday sales. So if you do consider shopping, if you do shop, consider using my affiliate links. I am also, for the month of November, giving away some freebies. I've got two sheets of holiday stickers for you and some other stuff that I'm going to send you if you make a purchase using my affiliate link. Just make sure to fill out that freebie form before the end of the month to let me know what affiliate links you used when you shopped and I will get those sent out to you. When you shop using my affiliate link, it does support me as a content creator. The companies usually pay me a small commission, but it's at no extra cost to you. Just click the links, shop like you normally would. And yeah, like I said, fill out that freebie form so I can send you some fun freebies as my way of saying thank you for supporting me and using my links. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I know plan with me's, I, I feel like I'm kind of all over the place. I'm still trying to figure them out, but I know some of you do like to see them and see the way I plan. So that's why I do them. Thank you all so much for watching. Please remember to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and I post new videos every Tuesday and Friday. I will see you all next time. Bye everyone. Thank you.